kids, my name is Joycey Horsey. Are you ready to read with me? Yes, yes, yep, yep, yes! Yep, 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 yep. Okay, let's go! Hi there! Before we begin, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe! Today, we are going to read the book, Winnie and Wilbur, Stay at Home. Are you ready? Let's begin! Winnie the witch and her big black cat, Wilbur, loved to fly about on her broomstick and look down at the crowds of people on the street below. But now, the streets were empty, and Winnie and Wilbur had to stay at home. The scientist on the TV said, Stay at home to keep everyone safe. Here are some things that you must all do to stay safe. Blithering broomsticks, cried Winnie. It will be hard staying at home all the time. Keep washing your hands and don't touch your face, said the scientist. Wilbur liked to lick his paws and wash his face. So Winnie made Wilbur a special collar. Wilbur didn't want to wear it. He wiggled his tail angrily, which tickled Winnie on her nose. Ah, 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 went Winnie. Be sure to catch your sneezes in a tissue and then throw it away, continued the voice of the scientist. A tissue! went Winnie, grabbing the tissues Wilbur handed her. Winnie washed her hands with lots of lovely bubbly soap and sang a song whilst she washed. Rub-a-dub-dub, blinkety-plank, I'm washing my hands in the sink. Rub a dub dub, blink a team blink. I'm washing my hands in the sink. She sang loudly. Wilbur washed his paws too and popped the bubbles as they floated past. Come on, Wilbur, let's find something fun to do, said Winnie. Wilbur pointed at the computer. I know, said Winnie. We can get fit. <laughs> Winnie and Wilbur tried out an online exercise class. And now, get your hula hoop, said the instructor. One, two, three. Watch out, Wilbur, cried Winnie, as her legs tangled together. Let's make some yummy pumpkin lunch now, Winnie said. So they went into the garden and Winnie picked the biggest pumpkin she could find. She waved her magic wand, counted to three, and shouted, Abracadabra! And there on the kitchen table was pumpkin soup, pumpkin pie, and pumpkin cake. Delicious, said Winnie. Now eat up, Wilbur! After lunch, Winnie got her books out. Come on, Wilbur, we need to keep up our learning, she said. I can help you with your spelling. But Winnie wasn't very good at spelling, and Wilbur had to help her out. Meow, said Wilbur. Yes, good idea, Wilbur. Let's paint a picture of a rainbow and put it in our window. But Winnie only had black paint, so she waved her magic wand. Suddenly, there were lots of colors everywhere, and Wilbur looked like a rainbow too. (laughs) 
What's that sound, Wilbur? Asked Winnie. All Winnie's neighbors were outside their houses, making lots of noise to thank all the carers. Let's clap as loudly as we can, cried Winnie. Hip, hip, hooray! Then Winnie had an excellent idea. She waved her magic wand. Abracadabra! And a rainbow appeared over the whole street. What a fun day, Wilbur. Staying at home is not so bad after all. Especially when we've got each other, said Winnie. We've just got time for a story, and then let's go to sleep. Purr, 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 said Wilbur, settling down to listen to his favorite book. The End Hi kids, my name is Cookie Cow. See you next time. Bye.